You say you'll be down in five The smell of your perfume Is floating down the stairs You're fixing up your hair like you do I know that I'll be a mess The second that I see you You won't be surprised It happens every time It's nothing new It's always on a night like tonight I thank God you can read my mind Cause when you look at me with those eyes oh, I'm speechless Staring at you, standing there in that dress What it's doing to me ain't a secret Cause watching you is all that I can do And I'm speechless You already know that you're my weakness After all this time I'm just as nervous Every time you walk into the room Something to me And I've been in a daze Ever since the day that we met You take the breath out of my lungs Can't even fight it And all of the words out of my mouth Without even trying And I'm speechless Staring at you, standing there in that dress What it's doing to me ain't a secret Cause watching you is all that I can do And I'm speechless You already know that you're my weakness After all this time I'm just as nervous Every time you walk into the room Watching you is all that I can do oh, 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 I'm speechless You already know that you're my weakness After all this time I'm just as nervous Every time you walk into the room I'm speechless Oh, you know it, baby Give you a 
to wish them well and to help make this a memorable day for them both. A marriage can only take place in premises that have been registered for that purpose. It is my duty to inform you that this room in which we are now met has been duly sanctioned according to law for the celebration of marriages. However, if any person present knows of any lawful impediment to this marriage, they should declare it now. <laughs> Mitchell and Christina, before you are joined in matrimony, I have to remind you of the solemn and binding character of the vows that you are now each about to make. Marriage, according to the law of this country, is the union of two people voluntarily entered into for life to the exclusion of all others. So now it's so I'm now going to ask you each in turn to declare that you do not know of any lawful reason why you may not be married to each other. So starting with Mitchell, if you can please answer with I am to the following question. Are you, Mitchell Paul Dempsey, free lawfully to marry Christina Jane Sweeney? I am. And are you, Christina Jane Sweeney, free lawfully to marry Mitchell Paul Dempsey? I am. And can you both please respond, and I will, to the following question. Mitchell, will you take Christina to be your lawful wedded wife? Will you love, respect, and care for her? I will. And Christina, will you take Mitchell to be your lawful wedded husband? Will you love, respect, and care for him? I will. And now the solemn moment has come for Mitchell and Christina to contract their marriage before you, their witnesses. So at this very special point in the ceremony, if I could ask you please to stand. <coughs> and I just have to ask a question. David, do you give Christina to be married to Mitchell? I don't. special vow, as I'll pass you over the threshold, it's your new phase of life, you're married. So Mitchell, I, Mitchell Paul Dempsey. I am. So, I'm Mitchell. Oh, so I, Mitchell Paul Dempsey. Sorry. Take you, Christina Jane Sweeney. Take you, Christina Jane Sweeney. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. I, Christina Jane Sweeney. I, Christina Jane Sweeney. Take you, Mitchell Paul Dempsey. Take you, Mitchell Paul Dempsey. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. Can the guests please be seated? <coughs> because there are now some additional vows that Mitchell and Christina have chosen to make to each other. So again, Mitchell, you're going to. Christina, I promise to be your husband. Christina, I promise to be your husband. In times of joy and in times of trouble. In times of joy and in times of trouble. <laughs> to provide for and support you. To provide for and support you. And support you. Support you. Sorry. In friendship, trust and love. In friendship, trust and love. I promise to work with you. I promise to work with you. To build our lives together. To build our lives together. May our love bring us closer. May our love bring us closer. To create a home. To create a home. To create a home. Filled with peace, happiness and love. To be filled with peace, happiness and love. Mitchell, I promise to love you forever. Mitchell, I promise to love you forever. And to be open, honest, and faithful to you. And to be open, honest, and faithful to you. 
to support your dreams, to support your dreams, and to respect your thoughts and feelings, and to respect your thoughts and feelings. I promise to stand with you. I promise to stand with you as we share this life, as we, as we share this life, <laughs> and cherish the memories we make together, and cherish the memories we make together. <laughs> token of my love and affection and in recognition of our shared life together and in recognition of our shared life together were it with the feeling of love and joy were it with the feeling of love and joy i choose you to be my wife i choose you to be my wife this day and every day this day and every day <laughs> token as my of my love and affection and in recognition of our shared life and in recognition of our shared life together wear it with the feeling of love and joy wear it with the feeling of love and joy i choose you to be my husband i choose you to be my husband this day and every this day and every day so just remain exactly as you want. the purpose of marriage is that you may always love care and support each other through all the joys and sorrows of life and that love may be fulfilled in a relationship of permanent and continuing commitment. I'm sure each and every person in this room trusts that it's going to come true for you both. Mitchell and Christina, you have both made the declarations prescribed by law. They've made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of your families and friends here today. Having symbolised your marriage by the joining of hands and the giving and receiving of rings, it is my privilege and indeed my very great pleasure to declare that you are now husband and wife. And Mitchell, you may kiss your new wife. <laughs>
sipping on coffee in it My knowing you know best friend The steel of my t-shirt My reason for speeding home from work My saving grace, my everything I've never been more sure that you're my person Thank you. 
嘅，叫做美王。我唔收你幾成？幾成？唔咁嘅方式。
Uh, Christine, I'm uh, the course back here for you. Uh, I would like to say uh, I love you. I always love you. I always love you. Uh, we've been together now a long time. Yes. Uh, okay. Yes. How I met Christina. It's happening, people. Uh, I went to see another little dance. Turns out Christina also danced. Didn't see my little sister dance once. <laughs> Searching for Christina the whole the whole period. Why is it It's true so far! I was just saying it. And you've got it on your video. I was fixing it from the moment that I saw it. It didn't work out the first time. We were young. Came back around. Uh, we've got girls over 18, and ever since, <laughs> that's uh, what this is here from the rain. So uh, thank you very much for coming, so again, for my lovely wife.
I've got some cards here of famous people's names, and you're going to recognize most of these people. You don't know who you've got. You don't know who you've got. That's fucking boring. I'm going to say again. Are on there? So they're all a little bit different. Can't even know. We've got them. Sound the magic button. They're all a little bit different. I'm going to remind them down with cards like this. Anytime you like to see it, just say stuff I don't know. No, would you take this card? Don't let me see it. Don't say who it is. Very much I said. But show it to everyone. Make sure they're all the same. Can I turn back, guys? Is that okay? Yeah. Keep it face down and hold it to yourself. We're going to try some mind reading. Has anyone here ever had the mind trap before? Yeah, I'm going to say, 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 I'm going to Whatever you do, don't answer the question, just think about the answer. I'm trying to shout the answer out, sir, and I want to help me, okay? Come on. Um, I'd like to think around if this person is a man or a woman. Just think man, woman. I think maybe the person is a man, but I like the one. I'm going to try this out. Don't worry about the mess, we'll just say it's confetti or something. Think about this person's hairstyle. Do they have long hair? Short hair? Curly or straight? Oh, no, I think I got it. I'm just bold. It does take about half an hour, because you're not going anywhere, I spoke. And think about what they do for a living. Are they a singer? Maybe they're a singer. Are they a dancer? Maybe a dancer. Yeah. Okay, I'll think it all. I can throw them all up because I don't even if know you guys what oh, yeah. <laughs> If you guys have the chance to meet them in real life, would you like to meet them? Oh yeah! yeah. Okay, for the first time I'm out now, who is the person you chose? You can tell me. Okay, okay no, it's Eric Clapton at this point. Well, thanks very much. I'm going to grab one. Okay, Elvis Presley. I don't know if this is going to work. Introducing this guy. The most magical piece of card magic I know. So it's not the sort of card that like you saw before where it had you pick a card and pretend I can't find it. You see, I took two cards out that I thought would represent you really well. And I wrote your names on them, and I think I made a good choice. I thought, Christina, you'd be the queen of hearts today, and Mitchell would be the king of space, the strong, protective sort of person. So I tell you what I'm going to do. Your card's red on the back there, kind of go with the bridesmaid's dresses. I know she's wearing a blue suit, so I've given you a blue back card. It was there, okay? So we've got two cards, one couple, and a miracle just for the two of you. I'm going to see if I can take these cards and do something a little bit strange. That is, I'm going to take them, I'm going to fold them in half, and I'm going to tear them right down the centre, just like this. And you guys have probably heard the saying that when two people, a bit like the two people find each other, it's like your two better halves come together as one, right? So with that in mind, I'm going to take two of the pieces away, leaving one blue piece, one red piece, and just like the two of the day at Lancaster House, when your two lives came together as one, watch the two halves, as the two halves come together, and they together, right? And one. And you can keep that big sound yourself. And you're gonna go, oh, I wish you had watched closer. So I would you take one hold of the napkin there? Would you take it the other side? Make sure there's nothing hiding in there. No doves, no rabbits, no trap doors, trumps. I said doves, okay. <laughs> They warned me about you, David, okay? So, um, I'm going to tell you exactly where to look for this. I want you to keep one eye on the napkin, okay? Keep one eye on the hands and one eye on the penny, like a third eye for that, really. The pen goes underneath like this. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. You see, sometimes when I do this, 
Do you know, I think it goes up this sleeve or it jumps over here, but I do keep one here. But everyone always misses it. So I know. Oh!
Ladies and gentlemen, that's some live and sailing for the Oh, <laughs> 